everyone. You have come to Facts You Need to Know channel. This is the story of Italy, the country of heritages. Before coming to the details of the history, culture and interesting things about Italy, let's understand a little about the name Italy. Italy means land of calves. You don't hear it wrong. There was a time in the past when the image of bulls in southern Italy became a symbolic image. They were bulls goring Roman wolves to show their power and defiance in war. The name Italy originally applied only to the southern part of the country. Until the end of the first century BC, Italy officially became the common name of the whole peninsula until the Alps. Italy is famous for many brands around the globe. They are Ferrari, Lamborghini, Ducati, Gucci, Prada, Versace and many other famous brands that I cannot fully mention in this video. These are all Italian brands that are widely popular around the world. About Geography Italy is also known as the boot-shaped country. It is true that Italy has the shape of a boot. This is a country located in southern Europe. The important geographical position right on the Mediterranean coast has played a special role in the country's history. Much of Italy is surrounded by the sea and the intertwined mountains divide the country into regions. The Alps cut across the northern part of the country, with long, thin glacial lakes. In the south are the hot dry coastal lands and fertile plains, where olives and almonds are grown. One-fifth of Italy is covered by hills and mountains. You can climb mountains in many parts of Italy, because 25% of the country is mountainous. The highest mountain in Italy is Mont Blanc, with a peak height of 4,810 meters. It is also the highest mountain in the Alps. A beautiful mountain range stretching 1,200 kilometers through eight countries, including France, Switzerland, Monaco, Austria, Liechtenstein, Slovenia, Germany and Italy. The area of Italy is 302,073 square kilometers. The population is 60 million. However, at the scale of Europe both in terms of area and population, these are staggering numbers. About the National Flag of Italy The National Flag of Italy has a relatively simple design. There are three rectangular columns of equal size with colors from left to right respectively, green, white and red. Especially when flying the flag, the green must be close to the flagpole. Because of this, the Italian flag is also known as two tricolor. The present-day design of the Italian flag is said to have belonged to Napoleon Bonaparte as he led his troops through this country. Since then he has designed the flag of Italy based on the flag in his homeland, which is the flag of France. At the same time, he changed the blue column to green, his favorite color. Green represents lush green fields, the color of hope and the future. White is the color of snow-covered mountains all year round, representing faith and permanence. And finally, red symbolizes the blood of heroic soldiers who sacrificed and fought for Italy today. About people and culture. Since the rise of the Roman Empire, the art of Italian architecture and culture has had many influences around the world. Famous Italian painters such as Leonardo da Vinci and Michelangelo. Italy is also the center of the Catholic Church, which is administered from the Vatican, a country within a country. The family is the center of society in Italy. Young people often live at home until they are in their 30s even if they have a job. When parents retire, they often go to live with their children. Italy is famous for music, art and fashion. Music plays an important role in the spiritual life of Italians. This is the birthplace of famous opera music, and preserves classical music to country music. Two famous classical instruments, the piano and the violin, are also made in Italy. And of course, the romance in loving the beauty and creativity in contemporary Italian art is also expressed through fashion style. Milan is one of the fashion capitals of the world. Milan's importance in the fashion industry is beyond doubt. Italians are known for their elegant styles, with great dress. Italian cuisine. Fashion is not the only thing that makes this country's brand. Cuisine is even more famous. Italian cuisine has spread its reputation around the world, with dishes that make up the country's brand. Pizza is the pride of the boot-shaped country. You can find pizza in every store, large and small, or in Italian street food stalls. Today's pizza is made in all shapes and flavors, but still retains the delicious taste of typical cheeses from Italy. Almost any country, you can enjoy pizza. Spaghetti has also become famous in Italy, since the appearance of tomatoes. 
This is a type of pasta with long, small cylindrical fibers, served with a special sauce. Next is gelato, an Italian cream. Gelato is one of the signature desserts of Italian cuisine. This is a frozen ice cream made from milk, sugar and added to a variety of flavors to create variety. This type has a natural sweetness, so this ice cream contains quite a bit of fat. The Italians consume 14 billion espresso cups a year. Everyone knows that Italians love their coffee. But did you know that they are typically up to 14 billion cups per year? Which is impressive for a country with a population of just over 60 million people. Most Italians drink coffee every day at roadside cafes and luxury cafes. There are more than 20,000 Italians who work as bartenders. The average household consumes 37 pounds of coffee a year. Italy is the world's largest wine producer. The country had extensive vineyards and produced wine even greater than that of France. Italy exported $7.3 billion worth of wine in 2018, with the majority of the market being the US, UK, and Germany. About travel. With all its values, Italy attracts a large number of tourists. For example, in 2018, Italy welcomed more than 62 million international tourists become one of the most visited countries in the world. Places not to be missed when coming to Italy. The first is the capital of Rome. Rome, the capital of Italy, is an economic, cultural, commercial, and political center, and also one of the most attractive cities in Europe. The ancient uniqueness of Roman architecture, and the vibrant pace of life, brings visitors into an ancient story that is still unfinished at Roma. The Colosseum in Rome built in the 70s and 72 AD. This is Rome's iconic building. When it was first built, the capacity of the arena was up to 50,000 people. Although less than a third of the original structure is preserved today, it is still considered a symbol of the Roman Empire, and a masterpiece that endures with time. In ancient times, this place was likened to the road to hell. The arena is used for gladiators and slaves of prisoner of war origin. The Colosseum was once a brutal and bloody place. Up to 500,000 people and nearly 1 million animals died while participating in the battles here for the purpose of entertainment. The next iconic work of Italy is the Leaning Tower of Pisa. The Leaning Tower of Pisa never lost its appeal. Every year, Italy welcomes millions of visitors to this place to admire this unique strange shape. This Leaning Tower is located in the city of Pisa, which is considered the city of wonders, because outside the Leaning Tower of Pisa there are still 20 ancient churches, many magnificent palaces, and bridges over the romantic Arno River. The next destination is the city of love, Venice. The boats are calm on the river with the slow boatmen. This is definitely the image that makes the name of this city of love. The city of Venice is a wonderful city, located in the northeast of Italy. When you come here, you can see an overview of Venice that looks like a giant spider's web made up of 118 islands and 175 canals. The islands connected by 444 bridges. Venice always retains a beauty that is both romantic, poetic and peaceful. The name Venice originates from the ancient Veneti people who lived around the 10th century BC. In Latin, Venice means love. Therefore, it is known as the city of love. Italy has the most UNESCO World Heritage Sites in the world. One of the most interesting things about this country is that it contains many historical treasures. As of 2020, Italy has 55 UNESCO World Heritage Sites. Interesting Facts The Italian police force uses Lamborghini cars to patrol. But this is only a minority, it does not represent the entire Italian police force. The last interesting fact, tourists throw into the Trevi Fountain every day is 3,000 euros. Thousands of times tourists have flocked to the beautiful Trevi Fountain, where they throw coins for good luck. On average, visitors can throw up to 1 euro and 4 cents million into the fountain every year. This money will be used for charitable and community purposes. The tradition of throwing coins into fountains comes from a local legend that says, if you toss coins from your right hand to your left, you will return to Rome one day. Just as the old saying goes that all roads lead to Rome. In the 1950s of the last century, there was a movie that inspired a second legend that said, if you toss two more coins, you will find a new romance with a splendid Roman wedding. It is also the dreamy end of this journey to Italy. A very interesting country, a country of heritage, food, wine, fashion and tourism. If you find it interesting, don't forget to like the video and subscribe.
Goodbye and see you in the next sections.